the last algebraic structure that we're going to look at is the field. The field is defined as follows. So the set of elements we call F, we have the two operations that we call addition and multiplication. This is a field if it is a commutative ring and all the elements that are non-zero are units. And from this it follows that set P with addition modulo P and multiplication modulo P as our operations is a field if and only if P is a prime. Because if P is a prime, all the elements in this set will be relatively prime with P, so the GCD of any element and P is 1, which means that the element is a unit. And for those of you that need to fresh up your memory, a prime is an integer that is larger than 1 that does not contain any other factors than itself and 1. So this is the complete definition of a field. So the algebraic structure with the set of elements called F and the two operations that we're going to call addition and multiplication, this is a field if the following criteria are fulfilled. So for the addition, we have that the elements commute, we have the associative law, we have that the additive zero exists, and we have that the negative element exists for each of the elements. And for the multiplication operation, we have that multiplication also commutes, the associative law is fulfilled, we have a multiplicative identity element and we have the multiplicative inverse for all our elements because now all our elements are units. And then if we combine the addition and multiplication operations we will have that the distributive law is fulfilled.